dignitaries. It's a new month. The last month of the year. The month of Thanksgiving. Hooray! It's the last month of the year. Thank God who have helped us this far. Thank God for his unlimited mercies, favor and blessings showered upon us. Thank God for the ups and downs. Thank God he never left us alone. We passed through water and water did not overwhelm us. We passed through fire and he didn't make fire to burn us. His faithfulness are new every morning. Great is his faithfulness. You may be wondering what has God done for you. You couldn't achieve your plans for the year. COVID-19 pandemic has distorted your plans. Whatever your excuses may be. Know this that he still remains God. I want you to sit down and start counting all what the Lord has done for you. And you will surprise and thankful of what God has done in your life. Starting from the gift of life, provision of food, water, a house to lay your head at night, and many other blessings. What a protection from evil? No evil came near your dwelling, neither did COVID-19 came near you, your family and loved ones. Per adventure you were diagnosed to be positive with COVID-19, thank God for the healing power. Many couldn't survive it. Yet you are alive. It is not by your making, not by how wealthy you are, how literate you are, how intellectual you are, how beautiful you are, how handsome you are but by the mercy of God. Forget the things you haven't achieved and concentrate on his faithfulness in your life and family. Is somebody grateful to God? Hope you are fully ready for all the packages assigned for you and your family this week and this month. Alright. Let's speak into our month. Personalize this to yourself. I am seated where Christ seat far above principalities and powers. Therefore, this month shall answer for me. I declare my gates are opened continually and people shall bring present unto me. The treasures of heaven is open over me this month for prosperity and abundance blessings in form of sound health, overflowing joy, unmerited favor, heavenly security. All the blessing that has been withheld from me, I recover all. All those who are attacking me will come bending their knees before me. The mercy, grace and the love of God will encompass me, my family and my loved ones. I will not be put to shame. The Lord will provide for me according to his riches and glory by Christ Jesus. No evil shall befall me neither will any bad occurrences come near me and my loved ones. I am early for favor and late for disaster. I am blessed when I go out and when I come in. I receive power to overcome any circumstances that may come my way this month. Every opportunity that I have missed from January to November, will graciously be restored to me and I will recover all the months that the cancer worms and destroyers have eaten in my life, business and family. I receive all my expected blessings this month. I receive my 11th hour miracles. I confess I am great because I am destined for greatness. My path this week and this month will draw fatness. So shall it be in Jesus' name. Amen. Wisdom nugget for this month, you have long accepted the lies of the devil, I'm not sure I can achieve it. I can't make it. I can't do away with the addiction. I can't get over it. It's already over for me, as there is nothing to be achieved again this year. It's high time you stopped his lies by embracing the word of God and face the devil with the reality of God's word written concerning me. Know that what is written concerning you in his word is greater than situations happening around you. Have a great week and month. And enjoy all that God has in stock for you. Expect your 11th hour miracle. Happy new month dignitaries.